Les Nation, what up, man? Today is day five of the cruise. We stopped at Curacao today. We just have a. We we have a. Maybe we got, what we got today? What got going on today? A uh, tour to the caves. Yeah, we got a tour of the caves. I'm gonna take you guys along with us. All right? uh, island tour. Island the tour. The, the tours like that, it's not really exciting. It's kind of boring, but you learn a lot of information. So, uh, like always, man, before we go on tour, breakfast. Most essential part of the day, man. See you guys in a minute. Okay, I'm back in line for some more because what I just ate was nothing at all, so gotta make the line again. So, we were all looking forward to go to Curacao, right? But the cruise director said that since the waters are so rough, you know what I mean? And safety is the number one priority. We're gonna overpass that destination, so we're not gonna curse out today. We got this, so today's gonna be a sea day. So tomorrow we're gonna go straight to Aruba. Hopefully, what happened today to Curacao doesn't happen tomorrow in Aruba. We don't get off, so it'll be like four sea days straight. You know what I mean? That'd be upsetting. But the good thing is, we got our money back for the excursion we got today. You know what I mean? We had a cave excursion today, but we got our money back, so it's all good. You know what I mean? So we got a sea day today, I guess. It is what it is. Tell me what just happened. You put my bracelet on. No, but the cursor. Oh, the wind was too. Maybe you don't gotta get so close. It's wide view. It's not gonna see the whole. The wind was too strong. The ship was moving. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is the port, and this is the ship, and it can go like this, and it would damage the ship. So, they decided to take off on their ass. So, see day to day. Is that what you wanted? Like story time, story time. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! All right, baby, let go. <laughs> you know who's gonna see this, man? They're gonna be like, you know, the last your wife is crazy. I'm like, yes, I know she's crazy. Well. I'm not crazy. I'm crazy in love <laughs> with you. Psycho. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! So we just played like uh, what's that game called? The beanbag toss thing. Yeah, we played like thirty games. Charlie, her cousin. It's so windy out here, man. Look, look, look at ocean real quick. That's why we couldn't get off to uh, Curacao. The safety is the number one priority. But anyways, we're playing that beanbag toss. Her cousin won like twenty-four games <laughs> straight. I'm like, damn, man. Like this, we played like this. Every time he threw one into the uh, beanbag thing, it's one point. So he beat, yeah, it was one point. Damn, it's one about to fall off the ship. So he beat us all. Now we're at the basketball court, looking. Nobody can make a shot because it's so windy out here. Look at your hair. That's how windy it is out here. Look, that's the girl you said that plays basketball. Huh, who, what? Who, who you talking about? Girl that you said was dribbly. Told you, told you. You can talk about her look. You can talk about her look. You know I what I mean? You, I told you she could probably kick your ass. Nah, I'll be damned. I can never let a female beat me in basketball. Why not? I can't. Oh, you can't play against him? I can't let a, I can't let a, I can't let a female beat me in basketball. Oh. That's well, against I mean, my morals. I mean, if a WNBA player comes in here and plays. I beat the ass, man. I let no. no. Huh? What happened if it's Lisa Leslie? <laughs> She's not a fast. She's not bad, but she's just the same color. She could duck, but. I take her out. Yeah, take her out. How about take Candace her. Parker? Another one. She's gonna lose. I'll, I'll hug her. You'll hug her? <laughs> she's fine. The whole family dresses the same every day. Today's red. Oh, yeah, for real, right? You, see, you notice that? For your love. love. So, when are you out here? Look, look at those. I'm in the wind right now, it's at least, at least 40 miles an hour, at least. It's so damn windy out here, man. If we turned around and went to the, uh, went to, went to the short curse out, the boat would have most likely flipped over. I promise. Windy. So right now, we're just sitting down watching her cousin and her brother's friend for basketball over here. Oh, 
I mean, I don't know how they can play because right now it's like at least the wind is like 40 miles an hour. The ball can never go to the basket. <laughs> I don't know how they're doing this. You see the shirts waving back and forth in the wind. You see the wave. You probably can't see it because it's over there, but you see all the wave. How are they trying to play? What happened? What happened? You not playing no more? This way. You can't play on it. It's too slippery on that side. Oh, true. So they just ran a four. All right, okay. That's the person that got picked up. True, true. So we were walking around doing nothing, right? Because we didn't stop at Curacao today because the wave was, the uh, ocean was too wavy. We couldn't stop. We couldn't get on the, turn the boat because we were flipped over. So we decided to get some uh, more Starbirds. My wife loved them shits. My wife absolutely loved these. And I'm pretty fond of them too. You know what I mean? I'm pretty fond of them. So we're just going to stay in the room, watch some TV until 7 p.m. is when we're going to lunch, so, yep. So we just got back from dinner. We usually would go walk around and explore a little bit, but since the ship is rocking, the ocean is... Too much motion in the ocean! Yeah, so we decided to go inside the room and call it a night because we're all feeling nauseated. So, see you guys tomorrow.